wiki.easyvid.com. Search EasyVid Wiki before you decide. EasyVid presents the 10 best graphics cards. Let's get started with the list. Starting off our list at number 10, one of the few modern add-in boards small enough to fit in a mini ITX build, the Gigabyte GTX 1650 has the rare distinction of drawing electricity exclusively from the PCIe slot, so you likely won't have to upgrade the power supply if you're installing it in an older PC. It's the least expensive Turing-based GPU and is great for home theater use, however its game performance is poor. At number 9, one of the first ever produced with 7 nanometer transistors, the MSI Radeon 7 is faster than all but the newest GPUs. It uses Intel's cutting-edge 4096-bit HDM2 memory, which offers bandwidth unrivaled by anything else in the category. It can tackle any modern title, but it does consume quite a bit of power, and it is among the more expensive choices. Coming in at number 8 on our list, one of the more recent AMD designs to be released, the XFX Radeon RX 590 promises effective performance at a reasonable price tag. Its zero decibel fan technology keeps it quiet under minimal load, making it a great choice for a home theater PC. It comes with an extra large heat sink and boasts surprisingly moderate power usage. However, it's not ideal for high level gaming. Our newest choices can only be seen at wiki.easyvid.com. Go there now and search for graphics cards, or simply click beneath this video. At number 7, in case you insist on having the absolute best, it's hard to beat the EVGA RTX 2080 Ti, which is one of the fastest variants of the most high-powered chipset currently available. It's so powerful that it outpaces even the workstation-level cards from prior generations. It offers exceptional ray tracing, but it's not compatible with some PSUs, and it costs an absurd amount of money. Moving up our list to number 6. Heralded as the new king of 1080p gaming, the Gigabyte GTX 1660 Ti uses a 192-bit pathway to provide exceptional memory bandwidth, allowing it to buffer frames with increased efficiency and deliver refresh rates consistently higher than the base model 1660. It features an HDMI version 2 Spec B output and dual direction wind force fans. However, its 1440p resolution is subpar. Halfway up our list at number 5, the EVGA GeForce RTX 2080 XC is among the best models for taking advantage of NVIDIA's ray tracing and deep learning technologies without having to drop a ridiculous amount of cash. Owners of the newest high-end monitors and virtual reality headsets should give it strong consideration. It handles 4K at 60Hz in most games and includes an integrated overclocking utility, but its power consumption is relatively high. At number 4, while the chipset at its heart is a relatively old one, the ASRock Radeon RX 570 actually outperforms some of NVIDIA's brand new releases. Priced at under $200, it's perfect for a budget gaming rig, as long as you don't turn the visual settings up to ultra. It features a 256-bit video memory and all three major connector formats. It's great for general-use computing. Gearing the top of our list at number 3. If you're not concerned with crazy high refresh rates, the Gigabyte GeForce GTX 1660OC is one of the least expensive ways to get your hands on a new chipset. It doesn't really have any bells or whistles, but it's a decent model for staying close to the cutting edge. It works well for 1080p gaming and is capable of streaming Netflix in 4K. It comes with 6GB of GDDR5 RAM. Our newest choices can only be seen at wiki.easyvid.com. Go there now and search for graphics cards, or simply click beneath this video. At number 2, for those interested in the latest AAA titles, the EVGA GeForce RTX 2070 will let you run nearly anything at impressive frame rates without breaking the bank. It boasts 8GB of ultra-fast GDDR6 memory that has a bandwidth of almost a half terabyte per second. It's equipped with 2,304 CUDA compute cores and a USB Type-C port. It's ideal for virtual reality. And taking the top spot on our list, one of the newest models to hit the market, the Zotac GeForce RTX 2060 is an all-around good buy, as it's easily capable of smooth 1440p gaming at high-level settings and has a price hundreds of dollars below its faster counterparts. It's equipped with advanced cooling hardware and offers a decent 4K performance. 
and its maximum power consumption is 160 watts. Our newest choices can only be seen at wiki.easybid.com. Go there now and search for graphics cards or simply click beneath this video.